Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel, Jennifer Marie, where I teach you different ways to become a work from home freelancer. So in the past few months, I've been exploring a lot of different AI technology that we can use in our business. And in today's tutorial, I'm going to show you an AI logo maker that you can use to design your own custom logo completely for free. You don't have to pay anything to design or download this logo. All of the icons and fonts are royalty free and open source so you can use this for your website, for your small business, your Facebook page, or whatever you want. So we're going to go to namecheap.com slash logo dash maker. Now in order to download your logo, you will have to create an account, but creating an account is completely free. You don't have to plug in any payment information, but you don't even have to create an account if you just want to experiment before you download the logo. So you can see here, this is a free logo maker, create beautiful logos in five minutes. You can scroll down and browse different design templates. You can also click on view all logo ideas. And here you can use any of these categories to give you some inspiration. So let's say you're an artist, you can click on the artist category and get some ideas of the kinds of logos you can create. Let's click on chef. And the first thing we're going to do is put in your brand's name. So let's say you have an eyelashes company or even a makeup YouTube channel and the brand is Linda's Lashes. Then we're going to click create free logo. So this is going to take us through a few different steps. You can pick your favorite font. So it's going to get an idea of the kind of font that you like. I'm going to click this one. It's going to ask you this six different times to choose between these options. So just keep going through and choosing your favorite of the three options. And then you can choose what color you like best. Again, you will be able to customize all of the colors later on. You can also put in a slogan if you have one. So let's say lush and glam and then click continue. And now you can search and pick your three favorite icons. So they've given some icon examples here, but I want eyelashes. So I'm going to type in lashes, click search, and they're going to give me some examples of different eyelash icons that I can use. I really like this one. So you have to pick three of your favorites. If you don't like any of the options, you can keep searching for other icons. And then I'm going to click continue with three icons. So it's going to give us some results, but all of these are customizable and I'm going to show you how you can customize them. So here are some of the options that they have given me. And you can see that some of them have the tagline, others don't, and all of them are customizable. So let's say I like this one here, but I want to make some edits. You can click on it. And from here over on the side, you can click on color and you can experiment with any of these color schemes. You can also click on custom color and customize the font color, the slogan color, the background and the icon. And you can even choose a different, completely different color scheme by clicking here and choosing earth or floral. And when you're done choosing your color scheme, you can click on the X, you can go to text and you can change the font type to whatever font that you like. You could even change the text here if you want to change your brand name. And you can choose to add your slogan. Let's say you chose a template that didn't have the slogan. We can add a slogan and change the font of the slogan as well. And you can change the icons. So let's say I don't want to use this one. I, I want to use this one or this one. And you can even type in eyelashes again and expand experiment with any of the other icons that you see here. And then you can click on layout and you can try all of these different options again to see which one you like the best. So over on the side here, you can scroll down and you can see what it would look like on a business card, on a t-shirt, on your website, and you can use this logo on your Facebook page, your YouTube page, your Instagram. So all you have to do to download your logo is click here on sign up or log in to download and just click on sign up. And then you're just going to create a username, your password, your first and last name and your email address. 
and then click create account and continue. So then it will automatically download your logo. So right here at the bottom, you can see Linda's lashes dash logo dot zip. So this is a zip file. You can open it up and here you have all sorts of different files. You've got your cover photo automatically downloaded. Then you've got your little profile photo. You've got info here about your logo. So you can see the font name, the icon. So this just will guarantee that you are using royalty free or open source icons and fonts. And then you have a vector file section. So you can open up any of these vector files in Adobe Illustrator or also in Canva. So if I open up the default one in Illustrator, here you would be able to make any adjustments that you wanted to the file. You can also go into Canva and open up one of these vector files by clicking on create a design, clicking import file, and importing one of the vector files, which is a .svg file, and then click on edit photo. And from here, you'd be able to change all of the colors as well. So what's awesome about this AI tool is it gives you an opportunity to experiment and see all sorts of different logos without actually having to pay a logo designer. And this is great if you're just starting out and you don't have a couple hundred dollars to pay a professional logo designer. This gives you an opportunity to see your brand name with different logo styles and see what works best for you. And you can use any of these images in your cover photo or in your YouTube channel art. So this is just a really great tool for you to experiment with different fonts and icons as you're creating your logo. I also quickly wanted to show you that you can find other icons and vectors on a website which is completely free called Pixabay. Over here on the side, you can search by vectors or illustrations. And for example, let's type in eyelashes and see what kind of eyelash icons we could use. So just remember the ones at the top are sponsored by iStock. So you want to use all of these ones underneath this ad, but you can see there are 49 free vector graphics of eyelashes and all of these are ones we could use as well. So for example, let's say you wanted to use this one in your logo. You can click on free download and download it as a PNG or as an AI file to open in Adobe Illustrator, or you can just simply click edit image and that will bring you directly into Canva. And from here you can make any edits you want to this image. You can click on edit photo and add filters or effects, or even click here on crop. And let's say you just wanted to use one of these eyes in your logo, then click done. And you can go ahead and save this as a PNG and incorporate it into your logo as well. So I hope you guys enjoyed this quick tutorial and have fun trying Namecheap's logo maker. I've had a lot of fun with this. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure to like this video and subscribe for more tutorials on how to become a work from home freelancer. I'll see you guys in my next tutorial.